Okay, here are some more little slide licks that might make you think a little bit. Now, I love the sound of slide, and I know that traditionally a lot of guys tune them to open tunings, but I've always stuck with standard. But because I know the fretboard pretty well, and because I wear my slide on my third finger, so I have access to some fingers behind the slide, I figured out a kind of technique where I can get, where I can actually get some kind of shredding, some kind of faster shit happening. I can get some faster stuff happening. And here's the concept. I'm kind of rolling the slide off the strings a little bit. So in this case, we're doing like G blues, right? So it involves, that pentatonic shape in G minor, or it could have the third in there if you want to make it a blues. So what I'm doing is going, finding the D and G up here on the 13, 14, 15, 16, 17th fret. So I'm just kind of picking up the slide a little bit, kind of turn it that way a little bit, and playing with my ring finger, I mean with my index finger. It's pretty cool. So my right hand is going. But my slide is going. Little cool extra licks to do slide with. Do this slide. Do slide with? Do with slide. Once again, these are all like just little ideas for me. You don't have to play these exactly like this, but it should give you ideas on how to advance your slide guitar playing. Take the licks that you learned in the last lesson and turn it into a whole exercise going. And of course, always resolve it to a nice chord tone. So. Depending on where you do the other note behind the slide, it could be a little extra physical stretch between. Happy sliding.